The cell wall cell wall is a characteristic of a plant cell and it distinguishes it from the animal cell. The cell wall is considered as an agastic substance, i.e., secreted by the living substance, protoplasm, but itself is non-living. The synthesis of cell wall is controlled by Golgi complex. Three layers of cell wall can be distinguished. Middle lamella. It is the cement that holds the individual cells together and it is found between the primary cell walls of neighboring cells. It is an amorphous substance and isotropic. It may also fill the intercellular spaces in the supporting tissue. The middle lamella mainly consists of pectic substances. The pectinase enzyme can dissolve the middle lamella and as a result the tissue can separate into individual cells. This process is termed as maceration. Primary wall, it is the first wall that develops in the new cell by protoplasm. The wall is formed of cellulose. It is the wall develops in growing cells. It is thin and elastic. Secondary wall, it is found on the inner surface of the primary wall. It begins to develop in cells or parts of them which have ceased to grow. Generally, three layers of secondary wall can be observed, the outer layer, central layer and the inner layer. The central layer is usually the thickest. It mainly consists of cellulose and is rigid. Tertiary wall, in some cases, a wall is present on the inner side of the secondary wall. This is called tertiary wall. It is dried up residue of degenerated plasma lining. Three layers of cell wall can be distinguished. Formation of wall. During cell division, at telophase new cell wall formation takes place. The framoplast, a fibrous structure formed by microtubules, appears during mitosis between the two daughter nuclei and within the cell plate which divides the parent cell in two. It widens and becomes barrel shaped. At the same time the cell plate, first partition between the new protoplasts, begins to form inside the framoplasts. The microtubules of framoplasts disappear from the area in which the cell plate is formed and regenerate at the circumference of the cell plate. With the enlargement of the cell plate, they Microtubules of the phragmoplasts approach the wall of the dividing cells, the phragmoplasts disappear. The cell plate formed of pectic compounds Ca or Mg pectate. The cell plate gradually undergoes changes to form the middle lamella. On both sides of the middle lamella, thin lamellae are laid down by the daughter protoplast. This is the beginning of the development of the new walls of the daughter cells. The walls consist of cellulose microfibrils and of non-cellulose matrix. The matrix of the wall consists of pectic substances and hemicellulosals. The new and old middle lamellae are separated from one another by the primary wall of the parent cell. The secondary wall develops on the inner surface of the primary wall and is composed of cellulose microfibrils. The matrix consisting of polysaccharides, deposit of lignin, suberin, cutin, waxes, etc. Structure of cell wall. Primary structure. Cell wall has complex structure and can be divided into different layers. Cell walls vary greatly in composition and morphology according to the age and function of cell. It has following demarcation. Primary wall. The outermost layer of cell wall is known as primary wall which is elastic and transparent. It is first formed wall in developing cell and may remain primary in many types of mature cells. The primary wall undergo increase in length and size as the cell grows. The primary wall is chiefly formed of cellulose, hemicelluloses and pectic material. The primary wall may increase in thickness but this thickness is due to successive layer of cellulose layer towards the inner side of the cell. Middle layer, middle layer join the primary walls of cells. At maturity, it is not differentiated from the primary wall due to deposition of lignin in both the layers. Secondary wall, secondary wall laid down inner to the primary wall when the primary wall cessation of growth of the cell. The secondary wall has no surface growth but Undergo increase in thickness. The thickness is due to deposition of successive layers of lignin inside the primary wall. At maturity, some cells like tracheida the protoplast is replaced by secondary wall. So, the cells become dead at maturity.